There is one thing that happens like clockwork every year on the first day of school. I walk into my classes, the teacher takes attendance, and as they say my name, they pause and say one of these three things. Are you Grant's little sister? Do you have an older brother named Grant? Or, I think I had your brother. Oftentimes, I think they're just saying this to make a connection and recognize that they remember him. But, after years of being asked these questions, I'm so tired of it. I am waiting for the day that I walk into a classroom and they say Abigail Kovacs in attendance and then continue on to the next person. I want to be thought of as my own person and not just thought of as someone's little sister. My brother is only three years older than me and has set the bar extremely high, which is good and bad. I sometimes envy him for how smart he is and how high his work ethic is. Most people know that he has these great qualities, but it should not be assumed that I also obtain these qualities. I would like to be thought of as my own person and not be compared to someone else. I want to be proud of my accomplishments and not have them diminished by being compared to my brother's accomplishments. I have noticed the comparison increasing over the last couple years. People besides my teachers have started comparing me to him. I don't feel as proud of my accomplishments when someone responds with, oh, didn't Grant do that too? Recently, I have noticed that people have been assuming that I'm applying to colleges based on where he goes. This simply is not true. I'm applying to colleges based on where I see myself living for four years. The constant comparison makes me question how much someone with multiple siblings gets compared. I only have one sibling and I've seen the comparison affect me. I can't even imagine the amount of comparison that happens for someone with two or three older siblings. Although it can get very annoying and frustrating always being compared to my brother, I have decided to use it to my advantage. As it becomes my turn to be applying to college and taking the SAT, I want to prove to people that I'm my own person and the decisions I make are simply because of me and not anyone else. At some point last year, I noticed that the pressure to be as good as my brother started to affect my mental health. I was putting so much pressure on myself to get the same grades as him and be as involved as him that it was starting to take a toll on my mentality. I became stressed, exhausted, and I was running on very little sleep. This is when I noticed I needed to make a change. I needed to stop comparing myself to him and start thinking myself as my own person. In order for others to see me as my own person, I needed to believe it first. I recognized the differences between myself and my brother, but I didn't show them off to people like I quickly learned was necessary to do. So I started participating in things he didn't do and taking classes that he didn't take. This allowed me to avoid that question on the first day of school and stop people from comparing my involvement in school with his. I learned how to deal with the comparison and prevent it from affecting my men mental health. I think this year I have really shown to people that I'm my own person and me and my brother are very different. I think I have grown to realize that people are going to say things no matter what and all I can do is choose how I let it affect me. Now when people make a comment that compares me to my brother Grant, I do my best to brush it off and think about all the things I do that make me me. So yes, I am Grant's little sister, but I'm also Abby Kovacs, and I think that's pretty great too. Thank you.